Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. This video is gonna be a follow-up to my last video about cardio and today I'm gonna answer some questions that people normally ask about cardio and hope you guys will learn more about cardio. So the first question of the day is cardio catabolic. In other words, can you lose muscle by doing cardio? And the answer is no and yes. If you do the right amount of cardio, you won't lose a huge amount of muscle. Yes, you will lose muscle because when you're in a cal caloric deficit, you will lose fat as well as muscle, but the amount of fat loss is way more bigger than the amount of your muscle loss. So if you do too much of cardio, um, maybe let's say two rounds of 50 minute sessions per day, then that's too much of cardio and your body will lose muscle because when your body is doing cardio, it needs that instant fuel to supply energy to the body. So to have that instant fuel, your body will break down muscle glycogen rather than fat because muscle glycogen is more easy to be broken down and supply energy. So when your muscle glycogen is broken down, that means you are losing muscle. So um, my advice is maybe do at least one session per week of cardio for 30 to 40 minutes and at most I would say maybe four rounds of cardio per week at 30 to 40 seconds per session um, that's ideal okay so now moving on to the second question is cardio suitable for cutting or bulking so if you're cutting definitely you should do cardio because cardio will increase that caloric deficit and make it more easier to burn fat. On the other hand, if you're bulking, um, I would also recommend you guys to do cardio, but um, I would say for cutting, go for low intensity cardio. For bulking, try more hit cardio because you have that energy, right? So the reason why I encourage people to do cardio when they're bulking is because one um, that cardio will increase the appetite and help you guys eat more calories especially for those who can't eat that much of calories in a day and reason number two is when you do cardio when you're bulking um, it's sort of like a lean bulk and and it will decrease the amount of fat burn sorry the amount of fat gains and you will still look pretty shredded when you're bulking and you will not gain that much of fat at the end of your bulk <clears throat> so question number three are calories burned displayed on devices accurate i would say no they aren't accurate um that's because different brands they have different ways to track your calories burned and um, I would say if you really want to track those calories stick with the same brand and the same equipment for all the time so if you want to track them go to the gym um, pick that most commonly seen brand of treadmill and just stick with that so you can have a more accurate number at the end of your day. So, so that's all for this video guys. Hope you guys like this video. Hope you guys learn something from this video and take away some knowledge from me. If you like this video, please give it a like. Comment down below if you have any questions or any ideas for the upcoming videos because honestly, I'm running out of ideas for the upcoming videos so I hope you guys can contribute your ideas to help the channel grow and also subscribe if you haven't and turn on that post notifications so you guys won't miss 
a video when I upload it. So that's all guys. I will see you guys next time in the same channel. Peace.